Well, meantime, the CEO of the largest fast food chain in the world is sounding the alarm about Chicago crime, saying employees are hesitant to return to the office at the company's headquarters. News Nation Sloan Glass is live in downtown Chicago. And Sloan, the issue of surging crime is really at the heart of this. Absolutely, Nicole. And Chicago, excuse me, McDonald's headquarters is right here in Chicago. McDonald's CEO spoke to business leaders Wednesday and said the rise in crime is scaring employees and hurting recruitment, calling Chicago a city in crisis. Today, major business leaders have had enough with Chicago's out of control crime. McDonald's CEO Chris Kemchinski speaking out, saying he's having trouble convincing employees to come back to the fast food giant's downtown corporate office. Everywhere I go, I'm confronted by the same question these days. What's going on in Chicago? While it may wound our civic pride to hear it, there is a general sense out there that our city is in crisis. Several major companies, including Boeing and Caterpillar, announced just this year they will be moving their headquarters out of the Windy City. While McDonald's says it has no plans to follow suit, the CEO says the downtown violence is creating major challenges for the corporation. We had to have some conversations with city leaders about what was needed for us to be able to operate those restaurants. And uh, it's not going to be something that McDonald's can solve on its own. We need to be able to do it with, with uh, public sector support. The most recent statistics from the Chicago Police Department show robberies up 18 percent, burglaries up 28 percent, theft is up a staggering 65 percent. On the flip side, murders and shooting incidents across the city are down this year. However, overall crime is up 38 percent. Throughout Mayor Lori Lightfoot's entire time in office, polls show crime has ranked as the number one issue for Chicago voters. With only five months before Chicagoans decide if they want to keep or dump the mayor, her administration is desperately trying to highlight public safety improvements. McDonald's estimates that its total economic impact on the city of Chicago and the surrounding area was $2 billion from June 2021 to June of this year. And that headquarters behind me, when they built it, that created 1,600 construction jobs. Nicole. All right, Sloan Glass, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.